everybody welcome in happy monday oh my gosh it's monday already anyway i had a blast on uh tvsn australia got to show some really cool things and ladies we're into another vault show what, what are we at now we're on pink vault <gasps> pink vault so that means it's new this is all new stuff again and um we have silver we have gemstones we have like man some of these styles make me want to like i mean i've just been so creative i'm working on new styles i whenever i touch stuff like this more ideas gives you more inspiration so anyway i am glad you ladies are loving this but most of all i just feel like all my little precious pieces are going home to one really yeah. you know like i it just excites me to see you ladies uh yeah it's They're like, like your my baby's history getting their forever home i know i know <laughs> Adopting these pieces in my my first baby. Yes. Yeah, right. <laughs> Definitely makes us family forever. It does. <laughs> We've got Brandy with us today. We've got Ashley, Rosella, Dorsella, Dorica, Crystal, Tiffany, Christy, Barbara, Ruby, Christy, Leanne. Got a little bit of everyone today. Oh my gosh. I kind of feel like it's like cleaning, like a spring cleaning. Yep. Like, but sometimes when you spring clean, right, you're trying to get rid of stuff, mm -hmm. but then you suddenly get excited and want to keep this stuff. Like, yep. that's what I felt like with, oh, I love this. Oh my gosh. I want to do it in this stone. I want it and do, I mean, literally, I probably have ideas for 10 years now. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> yeah. But ladies, we're going to get started. And, um, Anyway, I know these are pretty serious shopping shows, so like I know there's not that much chatter a lot of times, um, and I apologize today. Um, I'm a little shaky, so I did my protein shake, but I probably should have had an extra piece of toast, a little bit more protein, so I apologize, um, but we this is what we're starting with. frozen. Oh, are we? Yeah. Uh -oh. Okay, let's give this a try. Let's see. Reload the camera. All right, if you want to slip that paper under there, I'll see if I okay. can see it. Let's see. Is it working? Yes. Okay. <gasps> it's Ooh. working. It's, does that mean everybody's still on with us? Yep, too? they're still on with us. Oh my gosh, nice job. Great. I'm not sure. I think I would have disconnected and started <laughs> over the feed. I'm trying not to. Oh my gosh, I love that you're. Thank you for being techie, Sarah. Thank you. <laughs> I try. Okay, well, we are going to start with that, and I'm going to bring it in. We've got the Message of Hope set up first. That's going to be J4723, J4724, and J4725. Remember when I was designing this, I wanted something tactile and feeling. I was already doing my galleries and stuff, but I wanted something that when you grab, that you had that feeling, you know? And, um, I, you know, I love that with the cross. So this was that first time that I literally built 3D, the whole thing. Um, that means I had to go from the front to the back side to get all these plays. So um, pretty awesome piece. Um, I, I just love the size of this cross also. And that is J4723, and that's just a regular pendant, not a pendant enhancer. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, it's still large, right? Because you can see the earrings to it. But I did do the earrings the same way um, with that feeling, you know, of just having that full, full piece. And that's earring 4725. Ruby says, sorry, crosses are so beautiful. I, it's like I agree. so many of these crosses. I, know. I, I probably have like a whole website of crosses because I just loved designing the cross, like I couldn't stop because I was in that process of learning as he was refining me. Mm -hmm. um, and I just, yeah, it's like they just kept popping out the designs. This is 4724, Becky Wyford said, so excited, I got something I've been wanting for about <gasps> a year and a half. Oh my gosh, the fact so that we exciting. got it, oh my gosh. Well, it's so funny as I was going through some of these items too, it's like, wait, I found one more here. Or I've, it's so funny. I'm literally spring cleaning through ladies because you have gotten so excited about this that I'm literally going through everything that I designed. And I really like to keep, you know, a piece of everything I do. I'm kind of like that, you know, even though I have the pictures and all this other stuff. And here's the next one we're going to start on. on. This is the Colossal Elephant set. We've got bracelet 4951, pendant enhancer 4952, 
An earring, four nine five four. Okay, so we recently, um, we, you, we, a couple ladies were asking about the earrings again. So I love that we actually have a pair of the earrings because those are the ones that just, uh, just really cool. Those are a fun earring. That's earring four nine five four. Um, and this is that bracelet we did in a seven, but it fits up to a seven and a quarter, which I really love because it's a nice little bracelet. Yeah, that's a fun design. And that's bracelet four nine five one. I love their little uh, noses kissing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you're familiar. We've had that one a little bit more recent. Um, out of all my elephants, this is the largest elephant I've ever done. So I thought, great. And this is pendant 4952. This one, I changed that to a magnet enhancer. So we had that really gorgeous enhancer that was on it. So, okay. Um, fluorite, ladies, bicolored fluorite, okay? So really, oh my gosh, we love the fluorite. Matter of fact, I've been on a search ever since to get, now I, I did find some um, ametrine, which is amethyst and mm -hmm. citrine, but uh, this one has been really hard to get the kind of banding that I wanted. He told me I wasn't realistic about the, the stone, and I just said, well, well I'll, I'll keep dreaming until I find it. <laughs> So anyway, so um, yeah, it's not something I'd ever permanently give up on, ladies. Like I, I, I am still looking for more, but you know, I really want that definition, and I want the banding because a lot of times it's just a solid color, solid color. But I love the layers because that's literally a history of what's going on in there. So to me, there's a lot more activity. The more bands you see, the more activity and things that were going on. And that's bracelet four eight nine five. That's a six and a half, fitting from a five and a half to an eight. Good, okay. fully adjustable too, ladies. Okay, and then the pendant. Oh, I love the swing on this one too. It was really cool. I wanted to design something that was like on chains. And this is pendant four eight nine six. Okay, magnet enhancer. This was the stage where I was doing a lot of those. Beautiful, look at that, wow. That so pretty with the teal fluorite too, if you wanna mix it. Okay, and one size eight ring. That's ring 4897. Whoever's the lucky girl. True to size. Awesome, good luck. That's a great set. <laughs> That's a good set. <laughs> Okay, oh my gosh, we, I love, this is actually, this is a close next to the, the, the um, cotton candy um, in popularity is the cornflower blue um, opal. And this is the one that has the quartz doublet, which has that really pretty sheen of color that runs through. Love this bracelet. Bracelet 6258. Pendant 6259, ring 6260, and earring 6261. Okay, so here we go. Going to the bracelet, of course, because it's awesome. And that's bracelet 6258. It's a size 7, fitting from a 6 to a 7 inch wrist. Look at that bracelet. Wow, that's beautiful. And see, look at the color, but there's just this really light... You know, all the opals have that whole rainbow of color, but you're going to have that really, so it's going to go with so many different colors, but you get that really almost like aquamarine blue behind it, but it's called cornflower blue. Um, but pretty with your tanzanites, your aquas, like blue topazes, there's not much you're not going to wear with this. Okay, so then I'm going to go into the pendant. Pendant 6259. Okay, the ring. Ring 6260. Ooh, that's got a good gallery in it. Yeah. Ooh, it just loves to be slight on. So pretty, look at that. Ooh, look at that hue of coloring. Isn't that so pretty? Yeah, it changes at the different angles. Earring 6261. Oh my gosh, my nails are atrocious. Oh my gosh, I'm so embarrassed to be under here right now. Sorry, that's what happens when it gets busy, busy, busy. My, hand, my hands suffer. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. 
you ladies, like it's, we're all family here. We can we accept that, right? <laughs> I promise I'm going right after today though. <laughs> Get my nails done. I know my girl, it's like, it was so funny. She forgot to tell me she was on vacation. So I Please literally, don't. yep, couldn't get in. We've got bracelet 6147, ring 6175, and pendant 6176. Oh, I love this King Mint Turquoise. Oh, it's so pretty. And with the Twilight Opal, oh my gosh. I, I love this bracelet style. I'd like to do some more bracelets like this. Okay, I'm going straight to the bracelet. And that's bracelet 6174. That is a seven and a quarter fitting from a six to an eight inch. See how pretty that is with it? The blues and the greens and then, yeah. Yeah, the mix of blues is very pretty. Okay, now the ring. Mm. Ring 6175. Oh my gosh, look at that. Yeah, this one was, this one fits, because it had a lot of uh, granulation work all around this. So I, I remember when we did this, I ended up pulling the gallery down even further than usual because I want that ring to stay up on top of your finger. Look at that. Ooh, what a statement piece. Yeah, that's a good one. Wow, that is, that, that is quite impressive. See, I love the big pieces like that. Only because I make them really comfortable, so you can't even tell you're wearing so you can, something like that. Yeah, not worry about wearing something big. This is pendant 6176. Look at the granulation work on this, though. Like, this is what I'm talking about. This is, like, I'd still be doing a lot of pieces like that, but it's 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 hard. You know, I still try to get some in, but, yeah, that, that work. Like, year and a half, we're finally done with the collection. <laughs> <laughs> it takes a long time. It just takes a long time. Okay, so um, on to the next. Oh my gosh, ladies. Um, I do feel like we have to bring this back. The torsage twist. Oh my gosh, because we have the chain link in this. Can you mark this? Mm -hmm. I need to do more sizes in this too. That's probably... Okay, that's... It, now, when I say this, ladies, just remember, it'll take me about a year to get there. <laughs> but still, like this one... We love this style. We and this love is this style. Uh, renewed inside and out. We've got two sizes. This is bracelet 4361. We've got a size 675 and a 7. The 675 will fit from a 5 and 3 quarters to a 6 and 3 quarters. And the 7 will fit from a 6 to a 7. Wow. Yes, this is beautiful. So, yeah, just really, really pretty on. Yeah, it's really nice. Look at that art. twist. Look at that. The whole thing. Yeah, that's a great piece. Oh, wow. Okay, awesome. Um, yeah, I definitely need to bring that back. Do you know how long that took to get the twist just right? Oh, I'm sure. <gasps> oh, my gosh. I love that piece. Art. Okay, remember, I did two different buckles, ladies. So I did the one that we have on our website right now. But remember, I did a bigger buckle also, but in that really cool style still. So, you know, for my ladies that like large and in church, this was that larger style buckle that I did. This is the present moment set. We've got bracelet 4731. This is a size seven fitting from a six to a seven. Yeah. And then the locket. This is when I did the cross locket to it. Pendant 4732. Look at that on the back, too. Yeah, the lockets. I definitely need to be bringing in more lockets. Look at that. Isn't that cool? All the way to the back. So you can see the see through. Yep, yeah, it's definitely a, a medallion. Oh, I love these too. Yeah, these are just really sweet. Nice size. Earring 4734. Oh, dude, we, we gotta tell Beth. I'm labeling some other stuff to get those labeled to where I can. We, I, yep, I did let her know. Oh, you did? Mm -hmm. Okay, perfect, perfect. Yeah. Oh my gosh. <gasps> this is. Wow, I'm not used to that. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Wow. Okay. Sarah, thank you for joining our team. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's amazing. Okay. Alrighty. Ring 4733. 
people usually have to tell me two times that I'm like, oh yeah, okay, I, I, I'm doing it right now. So I just, I can't even believe it. Thank you. Yep, she got her our special note on, was it last Thursday or both? Yeah, yep. I'm just like, wow. I'm sitting here, I'm so impressed, ladies. Can we give her a <laughs> hand out there? Can I have everybody, like, yes. Praise report. We have an amazing, amazing person that joined our team. I think this is maybe my favorite ring of the day. Okay, you know, of course. Do you know how much money right. each stone is? Okay, so I had to discontinue that. That's natural and treated Chalcedony. So when I say Chalcedony, this is kind of the color it will tend to come in a lot of times. Mm -hmm. Even even more pale than that. So to try to get that little bit of blue. But that's a real sapphire with the mother of pearl, the nacre of mother of pearl and the cords. And a tanzanite, so of course, of course you do. She draws right to the expensive too. I could taste. This is ring four nine eight nine. Yes, one size eight. Good luck. Um, still one of my favorite rings. Like I, I did this in a, a black, um, also thinking okay, it would be a more affordable. But all it did was Let's the stone went up by the time I designed this one. So I was like, okay, still pricey. But worth it, right, ladies that own the black version of that? It's one I wear all the time, my bracelet. Like, it's my go-to set. Okay. <gasps> More tanzanite. Oh my gosh, look at that tanzanite. Yeah, <gasps> that's a good one. This is ring 2318. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. Oh my gosh, okay. Yes, always, always fits good, wow. Oh my gosh, the color of that. See, you get the translucent, the transparent, and then of course all those like natural things that go on inside the tanzanite, little chatoyant there too. Okay, get off, you know there's one. Okay, then the pendant. Pendant 2317. Is it, oh my gosh, it's actually just as pretty. Holy Ooh, cow. That's a very pretty Do you see the glow too? Oh, do you, see, this was my go-to like, do you know, I still, my enhanced rebel, I still prefer this one, but I know everybody likes the enhanced rebel, but I, I love this style. I mean, it took us years to get this just perfect too. Okay, sorry, we'll go to the next. Um. Oh my gosh, I think I have coordinating pieces to that too. Oh, whoopsie. Okay, there we go. Sorry, I forgot the card. We've got uh, pendant 4998 and ring 4999. Okay, lovely. This is Sleeping Booty Turquoise. And with this one, sorry, my eyes are still bothering me from all the lashes. Um, okay, there we go. That's ring 4999. Really cool play on the mother, uh, the Sleeping Booty Turquoise. Okay, so that, and then um, the pendant. Pendant 4998. Pretty pretty. I love the micro fastening on it. Okay, oh my gosh, we got more tanzanite. Let me see, look at that. Um, okay, I love, this is like an ID tag, like style, kind of like what I did. I, I've always loved this pendant. Um, but the bracelet is so cool. Bracelet 6083, this is a 675, fitting from a 575 to a 775. See, great style, huh? Oh, yeah. Very low so profile. Isn't that nice? And who's that going to fit? A uh, 575 to a 775. And then we've got Pendant Enhancer 6084. I'm like, that looks like a 6. No, a 5? Wow. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay, and then um, one of the rings. Ring 6085. I love the gallery in this one. This one's so comfortable. This has the brilliant cut to it too, the diamond cutting on it. Mm -hmm. You can see the pops and plays of colors. Earring 6086. What I love is you see it, look at, look at it, lots of extra faceting. So you'll see that play of color, but a lot of white coming through because of the, of the extra faceting. Get that extra brilliance. See, look at that. Yeah. yeah. That's a beautiful tanzanite. Really pretty color. Uh, yeah, the faceting like that. They don't do a lot of faceting on that only because you lose a lot of materials. Mm -hmm. They prefer not to, even though I would still always 
order it and ask for it. <laughs> or I recut stuff a lot of times too to get what I wanted. Okay, so here we go, Caribbean. And I'm kind of excited to tell you ladies that I have, we're gonna have a special Caribbean show, a volcanic show, and a Mobby Pearl show. Ooh, things that fun. were literally one of a kind, things that I actually didn't get made, some of them. So they're gonna be pieces that I never did in that stone. Cause sometimes like I was crazy enough to like, I designed something to make sure that I had the right stone that I wanted. I would set five different combinations to pick the ones to that I would one was right. Yeah. And then it actually became not sustainable, Janelle. Like, cause my safes were filling up and it's like, oh no, none of that's sellable. It was just samples. <laughs> so is... that's kind of what I'm going through with the ladies now oh, because yeah. I, it's like literally never manufactured them, but they were like. Just one off special pieces you made. Yeah. So anyway, it's, it's kind of crazy. Literally I could probably be. Like, I have to be honest, like after the show, I was digging through stuff. It's like, I don't want to come to work today. I want to keep digging through stuff. You know, like it was so fun. And that was pendant 5154 and earring 5156. <gasps> oh my gosh. How did you guys get all this? I know. So much to have tonight today. Oh my gosh. This is amazing. Oh wow. So we'll start with the bracelet. That's bracelet 6435. We've got pendant 6436. And ring at six four three seven. Okay, I I think you got me on the system in DC. I keep trying to mess it up. Oh my gosh. Okay, sorry. Okay, here we go. This is bracelet six four three five. It's a six and three quarters, fitting from a six and a half to an eight. Mm. Gorge. Love the adjustability of it. And let's go for the ring now. We've got ring at six four three seven. And the pendant. Oh, the locket. No pendant. And that is pendant six four three six. Oh, I know. That's why, because it has the, the, the hidden it does, yeah. Because I was like, wait a minute. The the ones that I do like this have to be able to have a little bit more depth to it to fit it. Gorgeous. Look at that. So pretty. Okay. We have oh I love this little bracelet. This uh it's a one-off piece, it looks like. Yep, it sure is. Oh I see uh oh I took this over here. I'll find it home. Um can't remember. Okay, so I'll do this one. Um, because this looks like the hammered, but it's got all those little pieces of the flat jaw one that goes down the side. Just a really contemporary piece. This was one of the uh, first ones that I did like in this type of size. You know, I love this style. Bracelet 5229 is a 675 fitting from a six to a six and three quarters. Silky, so like I spent so much time informing the shapes and stuff to that one to make sure it was super, super comfortable. Okay. Next up, we have got a bracelet 5088 that comes in two sizes. Two sizes. A seven fitting a six to a seven and a seven and a half fitting a six and a half to a seven and a half. Oh my gosh, we actually had a, a second size, which that would have been so helpful. See, the ones that we're carrying right now, we only have one size in. Okay, so here's the seven. Bracelet 5088. And see how it how it fits in like that it's literally got that really beautiful little so unique I love the openness the structure on it's really really pretty these are one of those ones that cost a little bit more to make it it was a little bit more complicated it, it seems like it wouldn't be but it was okay the earrings we love a good drop earring five zero nine zero See, but you're getting the flat jawline on the back. I love this. Okay. <gasps> okay, this was the other buckle, but I don't have the bracelet to go with it. So if you were wanting any of the buckle items and you have this other buckle bracelet, oh my gosh, we ended up putting it into the same show. I think the ladies actually asked us to bring this ring back. I this believe. I kind of feel like you asked us to. Trusting intentionally set. 
We've got necklace 4955, ring 4957, and earring 4958. Okay, what I, I did on this one, which is really cool, see you have flat jaw on, and then I made this reversible so that you could actually wear it with the hammered too. So, is that the, there we go. Okay. Yeah, so you can have it on the hammered. So this one can be completely worn differently. Um, and you can also have your magnet enhancers on it. But it's really cool, it's just a standalone necklace. Bring 4957. The doodle buckle. You recognize it, ladies, like the other one that I did? Um, and then the necklace, it, what, it's a 22 inch. Sure is. With four inches of extenders. Necklace 4955. So it can go to a 24 inch. But see where it's structured, like the different sides to it. And then, of course, like these are those classic collections that I'd love to do like matching pieces to, you know? Mm -hmm. Just because they're such classics. Earring 4958, that's a fun earring. Yeah. Uh, the open space, it just looks really nice on the ear. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Oh my gosh, we're get oh, we got some pretty stone on this tray. We'll start out with some blue topaz that is a pendant 5140 and ring 5139. Mm. These are more classics, for a big 14 by 10, huge. It's like that's about seven carats of topaz. Ring 5139. Okay. Oh my gosh, if anybody got that, um, I, this is the blue-green Ethiopian opal that I did. Oh, this is such a pretty piece. And this is a true bypass, so you definitely could have some uh, wiggle room there. Ring 5150. I love how opal, because it's really like created with water, how like you can, it actually looks like sometimes the water in the Ethiopian is moving mm -hmm. on the inside when you move it. So beautiful. I love the turquoise color that it <clears throat> And a nice big one too. That's a nine by seven. An opal land that's that's very considerable. Tanzanite ring five one three six. This one is a uh, soldered shut. Ooh. Oh, okay, chrysophase. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is the mint chrysophase, which to get, um, there's a lot of different colors, you know, I, I mean, um, depending on how it grows, but this one doesn't have translucence. It's fully opaque. It is not dyed. It's, there's not a treatment to it. It literally comes out like this. So. When um, one of my prestige cutters, this was his rough, and I was just like, oh, I have to have that. And um, remember, it's not Chalcedony, it's Chrysophase. Chrysophase, like five times the cost. And Chalcedony is not inexpensive. So, um, and I love that it's with the uh, green onyx in the chrome daub side, like really keeping it, you know, solid green. I love the green. different hues of green there. This is bracelet 5021. It's a six and three quarters, fitting from a six to a seven and a quarter. Yeah, I love this. Now this is one of the ones that um, I cut up as much as I could and I ran it for as long as I could. We keep asking him about like cutting it consistently, the same color shading, you know? He's like, no. <laughs> Not gonna happen. <laughs> this is pendant 5019. Wow. 
Wow, that's beautiful. Well, this is, yeah. I love the rare uh, gemstone collections that I was able to do when I did them. Ring 5020. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. I remember matching all these stones, too. Wow. My, it's my happy place though. It's never like a chore. Like I love it. It's it's like a super hard puzzle. Yep. I can't do puzzles and where things like doesn't work, but you give me the stones to like figure out and shade out. Like that's where I thrive. That's your puzzle. Um, it's like, oh yeah, here I go. Okay, oh my gosh, here's my museum collection. I always say how these stones are made are just so amazing. And I have, oh my gosh, I have right now the multi-bracelet with the sapphire. And um, I have a three stone pendant. So anyway, this one I did with the Peridot. Wow, wow, okay. Pretty combo. Bracelet 6192, uh, ring 6190, pendant 6193, and earring 6191. This bracelet 6192 is a 675, fitting from a five and a half to an eight. Okay, so this whole pattern is done. Then what they do is they paint the sections in and then they go and they cut little pieces of mother of pearl to set inside of it. So it's literally like a little piece of art, but then you have that really beautiful um, mother of pearl shell that's literally pieced into the picture. I love that pairing with the, is it Peridot? Yeah. Yeah. And, and we, man, we have some good Peridot coming in. So this mixing with all the Peridot we have coming up. <gasps> Matter of fact, I just did a QA on a bracelet downstairs. I'm carrying three sizes in the oh, Peridot. Nice. Like, it, it's so pretty. So pretty. Okay, so we got the pendant. Pendant 6193. And that's the QA that we had done. That means within the next month, I'm going to have those bracelets. So it was finally the QA we approved to say, yep, it's ready. Perfect, we want them all. Um, you can ship them, you don't have to go redo all those. <laughs> <laughs> Earring 6191. Because, yeah, our process of how we do things, it's like, because it can get to that, like once we do, we approve it and say, okay, it's ready to go, that even if we make all of them, something can be off. It's like, uh oh, we miss this. Ooh, this is a great fit. Ring wow. 6190. This is good. Man, this is just a great, uh, this is really comfortable. I like and the band how it's alternating with the different patterns. And I love the open space of it too. And this is when I did it like a little off center because I'd like something a little bit like cooler to look at on your hand. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then you got your earrings. That's earring 6191. These are some larger stones, but the weights, the weight's not too bad. I'd be interested to, well, we don't have those gram weights here, but um, yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh. Now we're going into the green opal. These are those really fancy shapes. Um, now, you know, I did my, my jewelry in these shapes. Then I went and did the uh, stones. This is another one. We did it once and uh, literally um, my vendors, we're not doing that again just now. <laughs> so anyway, I love that they will give it a first few rob, but um, yeah, it, w it was really hard, especially in this type of material that we did it in. But can you see all the spaces? And I kept telling them, well, my artists are one that have to take the hard silver around it. Come on, the gemstone. But yeah, this was not the easiest. But is that just gorgeous? I mean, the color variation there. And the fact that my Arson's bezel set it after that, like there's tons of special going on in these pieces. Pendant 5217 and ring 5218. You know what? I wonder, will you put a take there? I'm going to hit him one more time with, please let me have this shape. Can what material will you do? Like you won't do the, I feel like I have one more ask in this. Because it's like I have so much jewelry in the shape that I designed. I really need to run a gemstone one more time. So, yeah, let's. We never give up. Can't hurt to ask. We just laugh along with him. This is the so, so into special. kindness set. Okay, so. Oh, I love this stone with this one too. 
There's a lot of really good little style bracelets, you know? I love that they're gonna be so different going to everybody because basically, a lot of these, again, we might only have the one piece of it. Yep. Bracelet 4966, it's a 675, fitting from a five and a half to an eight. That's a good one. Okay. Ring 4968. You can see even with the, the different, like I used a lot of those like kind of points to a lot of the jewelry I did in this phase. Pendant 4967. And earring 4969. Okay. Oh, the elephant earrings. Oh my gosh. I'm not sure why they okay. went with their friends. Well, we but... just have one pair. Yep, just I guess. one. Okay. Earring wow. six seven four six. Six seven nine six. Oh, six seven nine six. Yep. Okay. Very cute. Super lightweight. <laughs> Okay, ladies. Oh my gosh, we have so many good greens. Oh my gosh. Yeah, today's definitely a green day for us. Oh yes. Okay. You know what? I did. I did a pear shaped bracelet actually. Wow, this is really beautiful uh, green onyx. Holy cow. Yeah, the color on this is oh my out gosh. of this world. It's like <laughs> it's electric. Okay. So, alrighty, we've got bracelet 4970, pendant 4971, ring 4972, and earring 4973. <coughs> like, I really love the bracelet we did um, in the pear shape, but man, I love this ring too. And the marquee is a classic. Bracelet 4970 is a seven, fitting a six and a half to a seven and a half. Wow. Wow, the size of the marquee is perfect. The glow is just chef's kiss. Look at this. Ring 4972. Ooh, can you put a, a star by this? I love this ring. Oh my gosh, yeah, ladies. Like, medium. don't you feel like we need that green? Yeah. some green onyx and it, like this is the low profile vision version I did kind of a, like a little bit more of a um, statement ring and the one I think that's coming up this year so I'm thinking that could be a second option for people that didn't want to yeah, go like the, something a little bit low profile yeah yeah pendant four nine seven one and this is just a regular veil oh, make oh it. is that magnetic yep. okay um, Yeah, that's a great little piece. Oh, and the earrings. The earrings were the ones that I was like, kind of like, ugh. You got a cutie little bridge. Gorgeous. Oh my gosh, that uplighting of color. Like, earring 4973. Oh, very cute. Let's see, those are right there about one and a half inches with the, the draw. Well, maybe not. Hold on, sorry, ladies. Yeah, one and a half, about one and a half. Very pretty. Okay. Ooh. Oh, right here. Yep. Mystic mm -hmm. Quartz and Green Onyx. Oh my gosh. These are like all going together in color. Oh yeah. The yeah. center stone on that one is really fun. That is a bracelet 519. I'm sorry, 5149. It's a seven inch, fitting a six to a seven. Ooh, this is the one that has all that granulation work in the veil. And this is pendant 5147. Oh, and here's its matching ring. This has the press button with the little safety eight. 
Yeah, this one was definitely from uh, early on. My design career, this is great. See, this is one I didn't do always full sets, but oh, I do have a little ring I forgot about. Sorry about that. Yep, matching ring 5148. That's a great little ring. I remember that. It was really pretty, really different. This, this I'd say, uh, our chrome Cal Sydney, a uh, chrome chameleon. I'd say that last one, ladies. The Green Odyssey is going to be really pretty with the Chrome Chameleon uh, quartz that I do. It'd be spot on with it. Next up, we've got the Wonderful Counselor set. This is bracelet 5061, pendant 5062, ring 5063, and earring 5064. Okay, this one was one of those ones that I remember the bracelet, like it was one of those first ones where it was just like, I remember the person showing it was like, oh my gosh, this bracelet is like, be that one that you'd like put on and be just like one of your signature pieces. Oh, absolutely. Because the ring was one of those ones where you think, oh yeah. And another one of those ones where you put on and it was just so spot on comfortable, just the, the architecture of it. See, different, but yet still really cohesive. Bracelet 5061 oh, is a 675, here. fitting from a 5.5 to an 8. And then we've got ring 5063, earring 5064. This was a customer request. She just wanted a little hammer because I did so much jewelry like this. It's a good little staple piece. Yeah. This little cutie patootie ones. And then this, I just, every once in a while, will come up with edgy, just kind of different like things. And I later uh, used this piece for other things that was just really cool. I was like, ooh, I want to put this in there. And That's so fun. just a really cool little shape. Pendant 5062. Next up, we've got the Fills My Soul set. Okay, this was a one-of-a-kind set that I did, and it was testing, do I want to do the new patterning? And this is the one that we did, like, because Bali's full, you know, rice, all the rice, so that's kind of what the idea was behind this sh uh, shape. And this was my designer set that I came up with this design to see. Um, it was kind of weird, because I had done it, and it was about 25 years ago, and the person that I was selling to at the time, we accidentally showed it. Said, oh my gosh, that's really interesting. Mm -hmm. And then it was like, oh my gosh, for me to start a whole other pattern now, like I yeah. was like, okay, we'll do this. But, um, but it was always one of those ones that, you know, just for something different. So it, that's where my chain link came from, the basket weave. You know, I had to kind of decide what kind of things we were going to do. So that's like a bolo. Um, it's basically like a choker style. And this is necklace 4026. It is a 20 inch with four inches of extension. And then the bracelet, which was really kind of cool. So you do this, but this is when you slide over. And you use a little string. Yeah, to Sarah, will you t grab this in? I'll grab this in. Yep. So see, there you go. Cute. And that's it. So it, meant, it was meant to just kind of see where these kind of uh, weight over. So that's how the bracelet was literally designed. Truly one of a kind piece. Yeah. I mean, just one of those sets where it's like I came out, it was really funny. We literally sat down with my artist and I got this and I want to do that. But uh, yeah, just the choker style. This moves too, just like the bracelet. And then... I've done kind of a version of this in uh, recently. Interesting. It's kind of funny how sometimes something's in my brain. You come back and I, I just want to do something really edgy and different. So this one I did wider. The other ones are about this size, but I did a whole series like that. I really like the off-center type looks because they just look so different. Mm -hmm. That was ring 4028. Bracelet is number 4027. That will fit from a 6 to an 8. Look at these. So baby. So cute. Um, basically the ones that go on the end, I wanted that earring to match. And that's earring 4029. That was the necklace. But you do get four inches of extender, so it does go to a 24. 
nothing else like that in that pattern but of course everything matches in my collection you know it still meshes with everything i do mm -hmm. you know Very much you so. can still see it's like you're still can see janelle in there yeah <laughs> <laughs> method behind my madness Okay, so anyway, this went, made quite a spark at the office because everybody had not gotten these yet. Oh. And they wanted them. So I'm like, we'll just wait till after this show's over. <laughs> this is bracelet 6068. It's a seven inch fitting a six to an eight. So that these were little uh, pieces that I had done up. Isn't that so pretty? Those little it's like the amylite because we have all the fossils, the amylite fossils, and they I do come the from the water. Like little redesign. Yeah. So anyway, this was very very cool. Um, somebody who was with me for a while really worked hard on this. So this was something she helped develop, and she did the uh, the mermaid with it. So she did a lot of work on that one. Pendant six zero six nine. And then we've got bracelet 6068, fitting from a 6 to an 8. Nothing we ran for long periods of time. Like this tome took so long. It was it was pricey because of the, the abalone, because that's all inlaid inside the shell. Then we put the quartz on top. So not really realistic um, labor-wise. It was quite expensive, but really a beautiful piece of art. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Emerald. Oh, my gosh. Emerald. Right? Do you know everybody's, I know, ladies, if I even told you what this stone went up to now, this is the bracelet probably I'm everybody's shocked. been asking for, but it's like, uh-uh. Bracelet 4503 is a six and three quarters, fitting from a six to a seven. The emerald costs more than what we're selling the bracelet for. That's just nuts. Okay, we do have a locket. Pendant 4504. Ooh. Okay, but this How is cool. a steel at one Look at the colors. Actually, that I mean, that's not something I could sustain. It's literally a one of a kind, but how cool. Oh my gosh, okay. <gasps> okay, this one I have to bring the whole, like, see how I was doing all these cuts? Do you see why I made my guy crazy with all the different shapes and stuff though? Oh yeah, we've got the whole so if you see <laughs> for this. the trend of what he did. <laughs> see, because these came out about very similar about the same time. So now I'm kind of, understand why he might have gotten cranky on me <laughs> but still i still it's been a while so maybe i can hit him back up so um yeah full full this is the australian green opal which is just like a material that's just so cool it's literally one guy that's bringing it in and the fact that i was able to get like a barrel of it I, and to, to cut everything i'm just totally excited Bracelet 6092 is a six and three quarters, fitting from a six to an eight. Cool. Pretty cool. I love the rings too, to be honest. I have to do oh, that. Yeah. That's, it's like my, the mini one. I'll have to try that again. Okay, so. Necklace. necklace. 6091 is a 20 inch with 4 inches four inches. Mm-hmm. Wow. That is a lot of labor, a lot of gems. What did I price this at? Uh, the necklace, $199.99. Oh, yeah. No. I know, I did, like, I'm like, I remember each person and the labor on this, wow. Okay, ladies, don't pass up on that. Oh my gosh. Okay, so. Ring 6094. Look at that. Wow. I love the fringe of wow, my That's um, such a cool one. Prongs. Wow, that, I love this ring. I think the ring's the, my favorite part of the collection. Pendant 6093. Okay. Yep, if you don't want the big necklace, we got that. Earrings. Now, these are going to have some weight to it, but um, pretty awesome. Holy cow. Earrings 6095. Yeah, these won't be the lightest, but man, wow. Matching those up, holy cow. Have a color. That is really, wow. So, like, yeah, love, love. Okay, oh my gosh, I love this bracelet. 
I love this bracelet. I loved it because you could wear it as a tip to tip. Oh, oops, I forget. See, I'm this is the Sets of Faith set. Take this guy off. We'll start with bracelet 6592. It's a six and three quarters, fitting a six to a seven. Oh my gosh, these were the earrings that I just, oh my gosh, I had so much fun designing these. I'm going to show you the earring first. What about earring 6595? Okay. All the little wires and stuff, I just think it turned out so artisan at the same time, just so like, yeah, this, I love this earring. Super lightweight too, ladies, like from, not like the opal. I like the, um, how the movement in that is going to, yeah, wow. Okay, um, yeah, and it totally different because it was like I was like so matchy. I was like, okay, no, I, I didn't like the earring once I finished. I went, mm-mm. Okay, so this though, man, this is a good bracelet. Bracelet 6592 will fit from a 6 to a 7. Tip to tip. Or as a standalone. Gosh, I think I like the standalone better. It is just so shiny. I love it. It's all these like edges, but look at the gallery too. This gallery was incredibly hard <laughs> to get finished. Yeah, because of all the, the, the scalloping. Pendant 6593. So you're noticing I did the scalloped like S swirls, but with watermark hammered, watermark hammered. My hair is cracking me up. I woke up this morning thinking I needed nothing four orders later. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like you lay out and go, oh actually that's gonna finish actually, off that. That's that. This is oh, ring at six five nine four. So funny. Okay, ooh, we oh this is the necklace. Actually, ladies, do you know that for a year I've been trying to put this necklace back together? Um so I want to show you how intricate this necklace is. This is one we are wanting to, how much should I put this for though? Because the expectations are. Perfect. Necklace is at $199.99. No. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm going to apologize. I am trying to bring this one back, but it's not going it, like never be below ever. Probably even for Jodo under probably two seventy nine. but it's the bamboo one that it's, it is just a work of art. And it's so funny, we're trying to go back in and redo it, um, the dimensions, and then here it is. This is yeah. necklace four five, I'm awesome sorry, four piece. two four five. It's a 36 inch with four inches of extension. This is the Supremely Happy Forever set. And so here's the bracelet that I did to match it. And this was another one during that time. This is a, like a rounded bracelet that I did that you could wear like literally this way or this way. So I did this more to go with your round bangle stack. That's a good one. Bracelet four two four six is a seven, fitting a five and a half to a six and a half. Okay, so those are the two pieces of that. Okay, you know what? I believe this was my very first Emily bracelet I think that I actually did. It was the first one that I did. Thing back then. Actually, these sizes of the earrings are much, um, I, I go much bigger in it now, uh, trying to get more amylite, but this, this was the original one I did. This is bracelet 5099. It's a 675, fitting from a 6 to a 7. Of course, not realistic pricing when I'm on the vault, but again, they're just my one of a kind pieces, so why not? Ring five zero two four. Pendant five zero two three. Wow. And earring five zero two five. Okay. I'm a lot. Oh my gosh, I love this collection. Okay. This, I, well, also, I just love this color because it's like praise your light. It looks so pretty mixed with your praise your light. 
to me it's that perfect spa green but this is all mother of pearl do you know like actually i couldn't even use this size anymore where she there's no way she, she'd make it this big you notice for me i've had to go down a bit in size now um because that's all tiling not on a flat surface on a rounded surface which is just amazing but I just love this style, the, this whole bracelet, every, everything about it. Bracelet 2025 in a size 7, fitting a 6 to a 7. So cool, right? Oh, yeah. And look at the granulation work, too. I pulled quite a bit of different media in this one. I did, um, every piece just like a little bit different. Green 2023. I think this is like a 20 by 15 stone. Oh my gosh. Wow. I wish that, yeah, she's not going to make it this big for me anymore. Pendant 2024. And I look at, look at the sides. I love this. I love this pendant. This one I did my very first time when I did the roses bail on this one. But I just love that. Little, little leaves. It's like a beautiful wreath. Oh my gosh, for the time of year. Oh yeah, it's perfect. Say a wreath, right? Okay, very pretty. I've had so many requests for the mother, like for that, that color coming in again. So I am working on something. Okay, my footsteps in the sand. Oh my gosh, I just love this because ladies, you know, it, it means so much, right? For that, you know, when we get too worn down or we get too tired that you know what you were like why aren't you helping me come save me like where are you but that's when he actually picks us up right if we surrender he, he picks us up and he will carry us through that he will he i have to tell you my last year he has proven that there is no doubt i must believe in the unseen because he just does the most amazing things every single time and i'm so unworthy of it but i'm I'm just so grateful. And I take those moments and just draw more close to them. This is bracelet 4030. We've got a size six and a half, fitting five and a half to a seven, and a size seven and a quarter, fitting a six and three quarters to a seven and a half. This was like the, um, and this was actually got developed. I only had one order that I did of the larger size. So I'm really excited to see who's gonna be able to get into this one. Cause this is the one I ran the most is this one with the little term. But you can see it's double-sided, so as it flaps around. But this is one of the best little uh, bracelet styles, I gotta tell you. This, yeah, this is my amazing team. All hand-twisted. Yeah, they, they do such a beautiful job, wow. Okay, um, today I read um, about like, it's pure joy to, persevere through trials, you know, mm -hmm. that he's going to give that pure joy. And I did, I'm like, Lord, help me feel more of the joy. <laughs> like, today I might need a little bit more joy. I'm feeling very tired from my rotation. Help me feel more joy. So like, and he said, come to him like another verse. So I'm like, okay, you told me we could talk about this today. Mm -hmm. So I, I, I'd love that. I had a really beautiful talk with the Lord this morning. Letting him know my body's tired, I'm tired. Need like a little extra on. And I want to feel that joy today, Lord. Get me going. And that was pendant 4031 and ring 4032 and then earring 4033. Yeah, these are like love, love, love pieces. Yeah, those, such, that story for me is just such a big one because it's like, oh my gosh. Every time I evoke such emotion with me because it's like, yes, yes. Like, I know it's true, I've lived it. Oh my gosh, this is a great piece. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? The engineering of this, I remember. Okay, hold on. This goes this way, to get this in right, see, for each piece. Okay, let me make sure that it's, oh, I see it, this one. So, I've got to put this together so it actually goes up that way. So nobody's going to have to do what I just did. So there's a true right side and a left side to it. And this is the Keep Your Promises set that we've got. Ha! <laughs> 
ha ha. No, not quite. Somebody has interwoven it. It's got its bag out. While she's working on that, I'm gonna go grab Mickey, see if we've got any requests in our way. Nope, it goes this way. Should have probably done this before the show. She got a little tangled. There we go. Well, oh, that's cool. Okay, so no, because the engineering of this is like literally perfection. But it's so funny, even with the three strand bracelet, if you put one through the loop, it doesn't work. So that's why it's so hard to design these two. But to see where it's, where each ring, and it's literally a, a two layer necklace. Man, I love this. I want, I wish I could, we, they could see this on because it is such a pretty necklace on. And I love this. I did this open space bracelet. So the bracelet I did with it, you know what? I'm not sure if I ever did run this one. I think it was one of those ones that it might have just been a sample I didn't show. Mrs. Bracelet 5093. See? If it's a five and a half space. to an eight and a half. And then we've got necklace 5092, which is a 20 inch with four inches of extension. See how that's all connected? Then it goes down to this piece here. And then, see, it's incredibly hard to make a piece like this. I love that. Over, oh, necklace. and now I've got it backwards. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, wow. I'd actually really like to keep this piece. <laughs> you can even put a pen in it's the like, on the oh bottom my, portion. Oh, yeah, yeah. A lot of the pieces that I had, let me see with the scallop. Let me make sure that it will work. And then you've got the earrings and ring up here as well. Because with the teeth like that, I want to make sure. Oh, it does. Yes, it will. It, it will work actually. Perfect. <gasps> yeah, because the teeth with all the teeth, it does lay in there good. Nice. Oh my gosh. Okay. And then we've got the rings. Oh, and earrings. I, okay, so I'm not yeah. even done. <laughs> Got so excited about that two-step bracelet. Because there was more of this. Ed, they wanted more of the open space type jewelry. The jewelry that had, the see, look at all the watermark yeah. goes down into that too. We've got ring 5094 and then earring 5095. Yeah, these, oh my gosh. I, like this one is just perfect. I, yeah, I might have to get the dimensions to that one again because redoing that again, I I'm, I need to make sure I kept my recipe. <laughs> it's a good recipe. It's like, oh my gosh, these are the kind of things that takes me years sometimes to work out. That's why I was like, okay. And then we never showed it once it was done. So, oh my gosh, I remember this one. Uh, oh my gosh, the carrot weed in this stone is crazy. Um, and very chic. Yeah, this is a fun Ooh. one. Oh, I love the color of this. Bracelet 5212. Uh, that is a 675 fitting from a 6 to a 7. And this is the Green, ref green Reflections Mystic Quartz. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, it's that Green Reflections. See, I think we have something like that coming this year. Okay. It's so interesting. Kind of, you look at it, it's blue. You look at it, it's purple. It's green. The Navelle, we own. used the, the Navelle and the Green Reflections were our, probably our two number one um, colors of greens. And because they just look beautiful, they have more light than crazy light, but they look beautiful mixed with the prick. That is a huge gemstone. I even think mixed in with like tanzanite to pick up those purple hues mm -hmm. that it's throwing off would be neat. Mm -hmm. We've I'm got doing a lot of multis. You know, I'm trying to do a multi in every bracelet. So. Yeah. What crazy light tanzanite together because two really rich gems. That was pendant five that. two one three yeah. ring so five two one four what? and earring I might have five taken two, two long, one five. Set. I'm so sorry. 
Hey, I want to show this bracelet though because it's really pretty on. Yeah, this is bracelet 5212 and that will fit from a 6 to a 7. It is really pretty on. Yeah, I have done so many different bracelets. It's insane. Like, I could just pick a couple and those could be our hero <laughs> ones. But I just keep making new bracelets. I love doing bracelets. Oh my gosh, the Solemn Seas. You know, is this Solemn Seas? Is that, what's the name of this one? Solemn Sea? Yeah. <gasps> okay, that's another one. And we've been Parada, trying like that. to We've been trying to cut to create, see where you, uh, see you get the green pop out of the stone like a green apple. Ugh. Oh. Uh, multiple requests to bring back that last set to review again, so. Which one? The last one that we just did, the green reflection. Oh, oh, okay. I was like looking at the stones so like, quick. okay. I probably was like going, this is ring 4131. Ooh. Actually, this is really pretty together. So let me pull all this back in together because you know what? This could, this has got that yellow in it too. We've got lots of chatter about the uh, green reflections. Everybody seems to really like that. That is ring 5214. And then the green ring is 4131. Okay, let's, let's, I, are they talking the bracelet? Because I think the bracelet is very cool. Yeah, the bracelet's fabulous. Bracelet 5212. And then pendant 5213. I think the pendant was one of those ones. By the time we got done with the stone, it was too, it was too expensive. I, I like lost money. I remember when I ran the pendant because it was too expensive. I said, no, just run it. We're going to... Because it's just fabulous. So now, oh my gosh, I'm like... But yeah, prices. Oh, I love this with the frangipani. We got to do the frangipani again too. This is bracelet four one three three. It's a six and three quarters, fitting from a six to a seven. And then we've got pendant four one three two. I love this yellow. I know, I know we keep trying uh, to cut the right thing on that one. But the other bracelet's really pretty. I love that. With all the fun panties going down. Because I do a lot of the Tree of Life. Mm -hmm. But I love the, the rustic fringe panties on this one. Okay. Green reflections. So we will definitely have to put down... I feel like I just designed a marquee set, which is like, oh, this is such a great little bracelet. This is the Unshamed Dependent. Oh my gosh, set. I see, I, I do this kind of pendant. I did it in silver and then I brought it in, in a gemstone. Oh yeah, um, That I designed, because sometimes I'll design my, my silver and go, okay, I need a gemstone on that. But look at this bracelet. Oh my gosh, we need this bracelet. This is bracelet 4872. It's a 675, fitting from a five and a half to a seven and three quarters. Oh yeah, I knew that was gonna fit good. Yeah, that's got some great like height and dimension. It's a great quality piece. Holy cow, yeah, I better keep be keeping one of something because like I'm looking at some of these going, oh my gosh. Yeah, if something happens to me. You're gonna have a lot of styles to run, with people. <laughs> well, we hope that. Go back to happen. my old good stuff. Uh, next up, we've got the uh, let's see, bracelet <sighs> one zero one nine. This is an eight, fitting a seven to a seven and a half. This has been that great bracelet. So a seven to a seven and a half. I'd say six and a half actually, because I'm six. Because I gotta be honest, I think a six and a half. Okay. Because you don't want this super fitted. So we'd say six and a half to seven or seven and a half? I, I think two is seven and a half, yeah. Okay. We'll get that updated. Yeah, because I like for, you wouldn't want it super tight, but it's yeah. Like this is one that it's done so good you could wear it like a little bit. And then we've got the coordinating oh, ring. Yes, yes. Ring Ooh. 1017, 
actually, you know what? It's a good silver statement. This is, I, yeah, with her tree of life, this was really one of her. See, I brought the oval in, but this would be a good one to bring back in around, right? This is this is the ring that I literally did all of our um, sarongs, our handicrafts. This was my iconic like piece that I did. That that same swirl you'll notice in those uh, pieces. And then I have a request to show this guy once again. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Yep. And that is bracelet five zero nine three. See, they have all the little individual watermark but they're all see-through. We've got lots of requests for this one, actually. This one, oh, you better, yeah. you better see, because they like the open space of it. So maybe, and see the, look at the low profile, too. Yeah, it's a good one. So I could do it there, I could go looser if I wanted. But see, they all curve just a little bit, so they'll cur curve really nicely. And it's nice and lightweight. Yeah, this, this is like literally, doesn't have the yeah it, it would definitely be more of a delicate type but nothing that you'd have to be afraid of like no i make sure my pieces even if i do something like this you're not bending it yeah like nice and strong mm -hmm. but still lightweight oh this was my second one and this is yeah right with the big uh, multi-stones oh yeah and that's bracelet five one nine seven. It's a six seven five, fitting from a six to a seven. Ooh. Pretty pretty pretty. Okay. And then ring five one nine nine. The color on that I like. And pendant five one nine eight. Magnet and answer. Oh, oh, okay. This is that bamboo bracelet that I was saying. Bamboo and chrome dioxide, such a good combo. Oh my gosh. And then we've got the pendant and earrings also. This is bracelet 6103. We've got both a seven and a seven and a half. The seven will fit a six to a seven and the seven and a half will fit a seven to an eight. Interesting, this is one I would wear in a seven. Like I, because I'd stick my other bracelets my watermark or my general, like I'd mix the bamboo with it. Wow, that's really a pretty piece. And that's bracelet 6103. See this? Magnet retention and then full bamboo. Look at the gallery on that too. Great piece, wow. Okay, oh, I do have some coordinating pieces. And um, wow, look at the earrings. Earring yeah, these 6106. Are cool. Oh yeah, these are nice. Wow. Beautiful. And that's a yeah, nice those are very dangle. chic, very chic. Actually, I'd love those even without a stone. Mm -hmm. I mean, just classic bar, like earring. And then pendant 6104. And I've got that. Uh, Day outside at the top mobile. Yeah, this bracelet is fabulous. Can you start this bracelet? Because I'm like, I would love this bracelet. That is a great, like, I've done many different ones. Okay, ladies. The peacock of faith. It's a peacock. A peacock. Oh, no, what were they saying? What are they calling this again? Pecocky. Oh. Uh, uh, peacock and turkey. Yes, that's uh, what it was. Pecocky? Yeah. Here's your pecocky. It's a peacock I designed, but you ladies, since it was close to Thanksgiving and turkey, a pecocky. So funny. The bracelet is bracelet number 2198. It is a seven and a half, fitting a six to a seven. Ooh, this is the tauton work in it. Oh, wow. This is a lot of work in this bracelet. Wow. The bamboo bracelet number was 6103. Yeah, this is one where you'll be able to, like, it's malleable. You'll be able to, like, adjust it. Adjust easily. this in or down to fit. 
See, you can see it's a little bit malleable. This ring turned out really beautiful though. Ring uh, 2200. That's beautiful. Earring 2201 and pendant 2199. He's kind of not as much as a cock, he is it? He's a peacock. Yeah, <laughs> he's, he's very he peacock. really is a peacock. Like, he's really pretty. Next up, we have got the Special Possession Collection. Oh, this, I remember when I did this bracelet. I don't have a lot of bracelets in this shape, and I did one in like a, but it's really cool because you take this, do you see how that opens? Is that just cool? Ooh, I like that. Yeah, this was like, yeah, I had a lot of fun doing that. Bracelet 2713 is a seven and a quarter, fitting from a six to a seven. See, and this one, you actually have to press to open and then press to close. Oh, oh she's... <laughs> oh, very durable. But, okay, that was, a, that was a Julia Roberts moment, like when she had the... Um, literally, I slung this, this guy all the way across the room. That is hilarious. Beautiful. Oh, because I, mean, oh, I, I think I wanted to put it on. Oh, yeah. And then we've got questions about the uh, peacock bracelet. Do you think that would fit a five inch wrist? Uh, no. Okay. Today. Yeah, I, I'd say more on the big size. It, like, yeah, it, I think that would be too big on you. That was bracelet 2713. We've got a ring 2715. Let me make sure. Actually, this one, if you're, I like it on my seven better. It's like borderline. It fits on my eight. But if you're a seven, this will definitely work for you too. That's a pretty ring. I love how flush it fits. And then we've got pendant 2714. This one I did a lot of the basket weave. And of course, the beautiful marquee earrings. Earring 2716. And these have the, um, the omegas on it. Okay. <gasps> okay. This is when we get into the Bali Crush. Wow, it, we really did have all the greens. Like, it really, really is. These really Every beautiful. shade of green. Do you know it's hard to get greens too? So the fact that we could do this, I was just planning out, like trying to figure out what greens we're going to run this year. And it's like, wow, right here. That's what we need to be running. Okay, the bracelet. Bracelet number 5938. We've got it as a 575 fitting from a 5.5 to an 8. Very similar to the green reflections, right? Yeah. The color. Our Bali Crush is really pretty, and that's in a topaz. Pretty style, huh? Mm -hmm. Ring 5940. That's a really cool style, how it's... The Jawan beads just connect the filigree. It's like on a cage, I like that. The ladies are joking, but this should have been the green ball. The green, right. <laughs> Hello. This is pendant 5939. <laughs> oh my gosh, my nails are getting to the, I can't pick anything up. I was trying to get a You're like me trying to get the ruler off the, the ground the other day. I was day. trying to get a paper clip off the floor this morning because I'm like, I don't want my cats to pick it up and eat it. And I was like, oh my gosh, you're going to be kidding me. I cannot, yeah. like I was around the room trying to. 
It's this like, I am not leaving till I pick this paper clip up. Earring 5941. I feel like my long nails have made me learn different tricks of the trade to pick things up. Well, and I think my cats are pretty smart to like stay away, but at the same time, it's like they think it's like a play toy oh, yeah. thing, and then next thing you, you know, you never know. Hmm. If it gets next to one of their treats, they'll eat their treat and the clip. You know. A little double snack. <laughs> okay, this is gonna go. You know, I did an all silver collection, kind of like this. So sometimes when I'm designing, yeah, I would have designed this about the same time. Is like, oh, you know what? Then I could do this one to match back with this one or this one to match back with that one. And this is the Citrus oh, Splash. See, yeah. See, remember I ended up designing, actually maybe I designed this and somebody said, you know, I just want that as the silver. I think that's how that came about. And this goes right into that same Bali Crush so you can mix these two together. Mm-hmm. Pendant 5205. See, I like the edgier pendant on this one. And it has these really great little pieces here too. See that curve out in that last bracelet that we showed you too? Bracelet 5204 is a 675 fitting from a five and a half to an eight and a quarter. See all these little bracelets just fit so lovely. I love that because the stones are on the side, they really catch light as you move. Mm. Princess cut that helps also. And here's the coordinating ring too. Okay. We've got earring 5207. Oh, see that other set? Like, yeah. And this was definitely my ring set because it's just cool and edgy. It yeah. looks pretty just on its own. You can wear it just on its own like this. So cool. But this I gave you the other band also. Ring 5206. That fits right underneath. Actually, if you're going to wear both, oh, maybe it's this the tag. Oh, I don't know. If you're going to wear both together, I think, you, no, you need to go. It's a seven. So if you end up wearing these together, do seven. See, yeah. But if you're just going to split them apart, you're good to go. As an eight. Size. Yeah, I like these definitely separate because you could even take a gemstone one. How cool would that be? Oh yeah, put it and in then there. stick it like. I don't know if I have one over here. I'm not sure. Kind of stack them up together. I'm not sure, but a smaller one. But see, if you had a smaller gemstone one, see where it's just gonna slide in there. Mm-hmm. I think that some really of those cool. little stackers mm -hmm. that we have those would be great because I just love this ring on it I just think it's so pretty on its own now See where it's curved for your finger oh yeah now how is this color the citrus splash different than the Bali high <coughs> Bali high is definitely uh, teal mm -hmm. and dark green like very dark green so it's a much darker green this is a praise light light green to it Okay, now this was one that I did pictures and everything of because Coman, like, literally we documented like three months of constructing this piece together for the first one for everybody to follow. And I told you I came in and I was like, wow, he had finished. And I was like, wow, wow, amazing. He went and completely sanded all of the granulation work off. Oh, no. And I was like, oh my, he goes, no, no, not perfect, not perfect. For, because everybody then would follow the people learning from it. Mm -hmm. But I have my designer Smith to say, that's it. Then everything has to follow exactly mm -hmm. the way it is. It's easier than if you're not creating the first piece. To follow something is much easier yep. than to actually. But I was just like, oh my gosh, come on. Like it was perfect. But no, this, this, is, this is how it turned out. And it's just... It's beautiful. Every wire, especially when he goes into this, we, we called it triple wire. Um, that gets really hard. Like, just this this piece is just truly, truly a museum piece. This is pendant 2207. Yeah, the whole series was just, yeah, one of those ones that I said. 
Yep, this will go in and see it's the highs and the lows of that. And that's how my tree of life kind of goes, that circle of life. This is bracelet 2206. It's some, a six inch, fitting a six to a seven. Some malleability there to that one too. Oh, there goes the tape. We're gonna need that. <laughs> there we go. Oh, and then the ring. The ring. ring this the is ring. ring 2208. We actually have this in a size 8 and a size 5. Oh, I released my phone. Kind of random with the you know size 5 there. There are but... some 5s that are going to be coming up too, to be honest. Um, Because I went back in. Do you see how cool that is? Like on the side. Oh, yeah. 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 See, Victoria said, I fell in love with Janelle after seeing this suite. I mean, I can oh, see why. Well, geez. The beautiful That's a lot to keep up on, T. Victoria. This one. She said, I've been here if for you years. If you started there, oh my <laughs> gosh, right? It's like a lot of pressure. <clears throat> All right, we've got some crazy light up next. <laughs> I know sometimes it's like, I, I do, there's so many pieces that I'm like, no, the ladies have gotten all these other ones like when you start so high at the top on some of those like some of the not everything could be that piece yeah but it's like yeah I, I always really that's oh I'm gonna show this because this is the Bali crush true ladies this might be a little further down that but is I kind of the feel like I need to citrus splash actually. citrus yep. splash okay now here's the thing what happened the citrus splash is really this uh we found after cutting almost literally the same color the citrus splash is going to be the same as the um yeah that's this one so this is same citrus splash and and bali crush same okay so yeah if you don't mind give me I'm, just one of the pieces it's this guy right oopsie he looks like him oh so this is a good time where I can show you. So now we just have the Bali High, but the Citrus Splash is literally, I mean, we were like same color. So we're gonna grab a piece of that and then we'll, I'm gonna show you the color because the Citrus Splash, like I said, those two together, ladies, it's one color. Um, it was kind of interesting because after because i used a princess the color is spot on like i was like that's weird it's the same but look how pretty it is with crazy light though right like it's just but see where it has just a little bit more color so do you see where the citrus and those so ladies like if you're trying to take pieces from the two different collections, it totally matches, okay? But you saw how pretty it is with the Crazy Light. That's why I love it too. Kind of excited to find something that Crazy Light. So I'll be definitely doing some collections with those. And like I said, you said Tanzanite. <gasps> so the Bali Crush, Tanzanite, and Crazy Light mm -hmm. together. Real be a killer just combo. Cool, calm, beautiful. I love this ring. And then for and the crazy light, we've got bracelet six two six nine. That's a six and three quarters, fitting a six to a seven and a half. We've got ring six two seven zero and earring six two seven one. Is that really great chain? Oh my gosh, we really did. Like it's all. It greens. is. I know it's so many what greens. What the heck? I love it. It's perfect. Because they all go to the galaxy abalone. Next, look at the galaxy abalone. Oh my gosh. This is such a cute little ring. This is ring 6089. Oh my gosh, look at. So remember, Citrus Splash, Bali Crush, anytime you see those, they're gonna go together, okay? Bracelet 6087 is a seven, fitting a six to a seven and a half. Well, this is just one of those like everyday like 
yeah, you have one of your bangles and then this together, like with another big statement ring. This mm -hmm. is the kind of ring I like to wear next to my big statements. We've got pendant 6088. That's just really tiny, cute. And then look at the little earrings. Oh my gosh, we love marquees. Oh, that's insane. Yeah, Imagine the two pairs of earrings. Coloring that's on ridiculous. That. Yeah. That's, that's special. That's Earring super hard. Super, yeah, we're like, get those earrings, ladies. That's special in a marquee because it changes the color. <gasps> okay, this is. This is one of my, like, oh. Captive heart collection. This, this bracelet is, like, everything. So the earrings, I didn't have the earrings around for very long, but this was, like, a lot of ladies' first statement ring that they got for me. Like, it was, like, one of the first pieces. Ring number 2247. Let's see, remember when you could see that beautiful gallery? Yeah, beautiful set. So see where it's... Okay. And then we've got bracelet 2245. It's a six and a quarter, fitting a six to a seven. What is it? Six and a quarter. Really? That's a good... I don't... Is it it? Six and a quarter? I don't think so. I think that we might have made a mistake. I think it's, it's a, a six, bigger. seven, five. Okay. What, what's it say it fit? A six to a seven is what we've got for the fit. Well, I guess the fit, just as long as they go with the fit, I agree with the fit. Okay. So <laughs> even though that might, six to five might be right, maybe it's a six, seven, five. It's, it's still going to fit a size that. six to a seven. So it's okay. Okay. Pendant 2246. Yeah, I think that's a 675. And we just maybe had a typo. Okay, look at that. Oh my gosh. Look Earring at all the, look 2248. At all the, the wire work, the granulation work on these are amazing. I love these. Okay, yeah, this was a great set that I had for a long time. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, this is the Nabel or the uh, electric moment. Electric moment. Okay, which to me was a lot like the green reflections. Yeah, it's a fun color. Did we go with electric moment? Okay. Because it has this, it, this looks a lot like the Nabel because it has the, yeah, this looks a lot like the Nabel. So beautiful, but I love this because it's got the watermark, it's got the frangipani. That was pendant 4899, and then we've got ring 4900. Yeah, That's look at the fancy cutting on these two. Gorgeous. And I thought this was so sweet too, this earring. Oh, that's a good earring. Earring number 4901. I love how you've combined kind of the trio of patterns there. Yeah, this is definitely, I mean, this was really the perfect stone, I think, even for this. Yeah. Bracelet 4902. This one fits a little bit bigger. What, what size is We've this We've got one? that as a seven and a half, fitting a six and a half to an eight. Six and a half, yep, yep. Because like for me, a little, little on the big side. So six and a half and up, yep. I agree. And this is the Electric Moment Mystic Quartz. Wow, tanzanites, praise your lights, green, like, I mean, I so many gemstones I could see, like, going into this, matching with this. I love this set. I'd love to do this in blue, a deep blue. Oh, yeah. Or pink. Yeah. All right, final tray. So if you've got any oh, this extra is it? requests, oh my gosh. let us know. Oh my gosh, we had the emerald pendant. Oh my gosh, this and the bracelet. Yeah. That'd With the black spinel. And that is pendant 6696. Mm. Wow. How many ladies hung in there with us? <laughs> I can't tell on this one. We've thrown the jewelry everywhere. <laughs> Uh, we've got ring 6697. 
Oh, interesting. This is size eight. You know how I always, no, this one was true to size. Okay, I had an all silver one that I think I said size up because I'm like, I wouldn't size up in this one. Weird. Yeah, fits. Oh, that's a pretty one. That is a pretty one. I love how the spinel picks up the, the colors wow. in the emerald. Okay, I'm kind of, I feel like you guys can save this one for last so nobody can see because everybody keeps asking for the kitties. This one's oh my cute, gosh. the mother of pearl. I feel, you know how Michelle does her sneaky peeks all the time? Mm -hmm. I feel like she purposely put this one at the end to be like, surprise, anybody who stayed gets the cat. Because <laughs> like, I love this one. She's cute. I, she is happy. She's just like so playful. And this is ring 4408. Oh my gosh, that's that great fitting ring. Okay, so you know she can't do this pink mother of pearl anymore? So literally, otherwise I'd be running her big time. Look at that. Just a happy cat. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Okay, so there, I didn't do a left and a right on the earring because we never made the earring. Okay. Four, four, zero, so seven. you're literally getting the one sample I made and that was it. So congrats on the earring. And did you see what I did on the bracelet? I made this kitty, this really fun kitty piece for her. You know what? I thought I had some extra stones left over. Would you put a question mark by Jess? Cause I've got to mm -hmm. be honest. Like I think the bracelet, I'd like to, it, even if we have 20, 20 stones left. I'd love to make this bracelet again. I mean, it's just too fun and playful. This is bracelet 4409. It's a seven, mm. fitting a seven to an eight. I feel like I had just only a couple like pieces because this is, this is so sweet. Um, I probably could do the kitty again in a, in a darker color shell though, but not the pink again. Oh, yes, look it. Well, you know, us that love our kitties, why not go full kitty? Mm, necklace 4406 is an 18 inch with four inches of extension. Okay, Friday or Tuesday, ladies, just so you know, I'm doing a bracelet with a mother of pearl kitty that has the pink, pink hair, brown hair with the white mother of pearl in the middle. Just so you know, so uh, Michelle, I don't think she even sneaky peeked it because I just stuck it on the tray. So mm -hmm. I don't think she, I literally did it when I got into the office in the morning. Okay, so that is your kitty. I can't wait to see who gets the kitties. And then we've got a request to show this. I think it's this long necklace, but oh if it's gosh. not, Miss Dorsella, please let us know. Uh, Priscilla? Uh, Dorsella. Dorsella. Yep. Dorsella, I can't believe this would still be there though. For $1.99, I, I'm thinking this one might not be there still. And that's necklace four, two, four, five. Because this one is like, do you see all the, the ways that this has to be engineered to make this work? Because this stays like this. That's why we're still kind of trying to figure. But it's in the bamboo, see? And then I did it with the flat jaw one that looks like watermark, basically. But yeah, this is a 36 with four she inches She said she did extenders. get it. Oh, she got she it. Got That's it. why she wants yeah. to see it. <gasps> Love it. So Yay. just so you know, you can double it up too, which is pretty funky also. But yeah, because we are trying to bring this, but we're struggling again with the construction, which just lasts, you know, we do something and you think, yes, we could recreate it again, but it's sometimes not always so easy. And also a lot of my people, like some of the people that were tired out, that's the problem. Like, and here's the thing, they're still, in, they're still in Chaluk and it's like, Pac, could you please come over for cookies and coffee? <laughs> we need you to look at this one more time, you know, cause it's like, it's, or like me and him were those like problem solvers, like we'll figure this out, mm -hmm. you know? We're gonna, we're so gonna me being here, it's like, Pac, I need you to go over there with Kadek. Okay, <laughs> so we've got, um, and the ladies are saying, yes, please bring it back. Uh, we'd love to see this emerald ring again. <clears throat> so this is one you know we have in stock right now, but we have limited sizing. I think we have four sizes left. And it's, it is, wow, it's fabulous. And this says it's an eight, and so true to size. Yeah, it's, it's amazing. But yeah, those are the emeralds. Those, those are a big 18 by 13 that... The emerald price is, uh -uh. 
Emeralds have tons of inclusion. I mean, it's just part of what it is. I mean, you can spend $10,000 on an emerald. It's considered eye clean, but a lot of inclusions. That's just the way emerald is. And it's still, it's just super expensive, rare, valuable material. And then we've got a request for that. Oh, the green opal. That's the Australian green opal. Oh, you know what? I was wearing it the whole time. I put it on, and um, so do you think maybe that maybe I didn't get a good enough tour because I was wearing it the whole time? To me, this piece next to like one of your great bangles for sure. And so we've gotten some questions today. If you've made multiple orders um, and you're trying to meet that three hundred dollar threshold for the uh, free pendant that we're mm -hmm. doing, um, if you do meet the threshold, we will uh, make sure that you got your pendant. Um, so send us a note at customer service um, if you did a couple of transactions um, and they oh. will total up to over $300 because they're buying one season, two seasons today. Oh, they're afraid they're, they're going to lose it. Yep. Oh, so just yep. send us a customer service email and we'll take care of you. You know, we Yeah, so um, if you know you added, because that means uh, we'll have Abby and Jennifer go through. Um, so please give her your totals and your order numbers so it makes it easier yes, for her to communicate helpful. with Beth. Okay, and say, here was my order, because I think they can go into their account, but if you give her that information, she can push it through faster. Yep, super easy. And so the ladies have some questions. So today, our 12 days of Christmas special is if you spend $300, you will get a uh, free pendant enhancer. And so there's some with gemstones, there's some that are all silver. Um, if you have that $300 um, threshold met, once you go to your cart, it will give you the option to select your free item. Um, but of course, if you do the one season- Oh, they get to these, pick it. They'll get to pick it, yeah. Oh there's gosh. like, I think six or eight different options. Wow, well, there are some that I have one of a kind pendants. Mm -hmm. We are gonna run another promotion, but I'm going to pick the pendants Ooh. because they're all like, oh, this, this. So whatever they have their order going that week, I'll be like, oh, this would go or that, like, so I'm, it's something I like Janelle special. Do. Yes. So we'll, we'll, I don't know when we're running that, but we talked about it. Great. Um, that is it for our show today. And we will see you tomorrow for our regular Tuesday social at uh, 6 p.m. Eastern. Awesome. Thank you so much, Sarah. Ladies, thank you so much. I had so much fun. And I can't wait to see what you got. Yes. <laughs>